Hello everyone, welcome to Edupedia World Videos. We are learning PowerPoint Advanced Tips and Tricks and my name is Neeru Varma. Topic for this session is Writing with the Pen. I'll guide you that how you can create a fact where it seems like you are writing with a pen. I'll show you some examples. This is one of the examples. You can see that a hand is holding a feather here and once I press enter it seems like that I am writing with this learning powerpoint. I'll show you one more example. Now we have a pencil here. It's writing here at Jupedia. So in this session we learn that how we can create these effects. Let's talk about this effect first. Now for doing this what I have done is I'll show you from the beginning. I'll create a new slide here. And what I'm going to do is I'll write something here. Alright. Now you need to select the text and after that you can insert any font here. which kind of uh, you can select any font from this like I have selected this one for the initial slide and that would give you a little bit that handwritten effect this is the other one the Bradley hand IDC so you have a lot of font here you can select any one let's say we have selected this all, all right advanced tips of PowerPoint let me increase the font also the font size fine so I want to give a fact that it seems like somebody is writing this with the help of a pen so first of all I'll provide an animation here I have selected this entire text which is written I click on the animation tab and after that I'll give the appear animation here now I want to see the animation pane click here and it show you the animation pane on the right hand side now this is the animation we have applied here advanced powerpoint tips and this is the appear animation I click here and select the effect options now under the effect option it's giving me an option here animate text all at once or by word or by letter I'll select it by letter here and second delay between the letters I'll reduce it to 0.2 seconds now let's see how it looks like this is how it's going to appear advanced tips of the PowerPoint now I want to insert one more object here any pencil or any hand whatever so I'll click on insert and I want to insert a picture here I click here I have created a folder on the desktop where I have some images of the pen do I have the folder here this is the one the pen images so I have downloaded some of the images you can do that with the help of the Google or you can try to find out these images from the clip art so these two I have already used let's say if I want to use this time this one click on insert so I have an image here now I'll change the color of the text to black okay now what I want is that this pencil that would move here and it would write the advanced tips of PowerPoint now I'll provide the animation to this object this is the second object so I'll select this I click on animations and this time I am going to select the the other options more motion path I'll click here so I can see that a lot of animation path are described here I'll select the option okay I have an option here zigzag let's select this so 
we do have an option custom path let's say if I want to select this custom path I'll click here and I need to provide the path I want this pencil to move here first you need to keep clicking and after that you can write you can roughly write the same thing here like advance that would be more like zigzag thing you just have to move your pencil so I'm trying to write advanced tips advance then tips you need to move your pencil up and down if you have a lot of text written here like we have we just have a single sentence we just have a single line written here suppose you have multiple lines and you want to show the same kind of effect you can use the zigzag effect also that your pencil is moving up and down there is no need to write the entire letter here I'm trying to write it because I want to show you that the pen is moving a little bit with these words so we are almost done okay so this is the path now I'll move this path a little bit here Wait. this is the advanced powerpoint so means you can provide a roughly idea that how the pencil needs to be moved let me play this animation now how fast this is moving advanced powerpoint and then your pencil is going to write advanced powerpoint now we want the both things to be appear in a similar way I'll expand it a little bit okay now these are the two animations I have I'll select the second one the the picture the pencil which is going to move now and I'll select this start with the previous now let's see how these two things move together no it's not happening start with the previous this is the one okay so we have seen that the pencil that has moved very fast but the the title the thing that we have written the text that is appearing very slowly so let's increase the duration of this we have selected this animation for the picture and this is the duration I will let's say I'll increase it to five seconds there are certain hit and trial that we need to do to set the exact uh, timing and the duration this is almost like going equal but what I want is that pencil move here first and after that it will start appearing so I'll give a little bit delay and the delay I need to provide here when the text is appearing so this one let me give a delay of uh, 0.5 second here let's say let's see how the thing goes I'll play this again pencil is moving here I need to increase the delay okay, now let's see what what's gonna happen this is not moving together like the pencil and the stuff you need to keep it like this the text that you have the motion path that you have given that would be a little bit behind from these letters because it's going to write like this I'll show you how the effect looks like now because we want that the letter that would start appearing like this now let's say
duration of this we need to increase again six let's say six second this motion path we are increasing the duration so this is how you can set this path and you can give the written effect if I'll show you one more example let me insert a new slide here now again I'll write here let's write with a pencil this is the font I have selected let's increase the font size a bit now I'll insert a picture here oh, I have one pencil let's say this one let's resize this with the help of this pencil I want to write the entire text now I'll keep it here I'll provide the animation I'll select this apply the animation appear for the text and with the help of the animation pane I'll select the effect options and under the effect animate text I need to select by letter delay I need to yeah the delay is very much high here so I'll reduce it to 0.2 second so that that would appear a bit fast you can further reduce it you can keep it for 0.1 second also it appear fast now I'll select the second object that is my picture and I'll give the uh, the effect now the animation effect select here motion path zigzag let's say I want to give the this effect I'm writing here let's write we are just giving the shape to the pencil that how it moves let's write with pen or pencil whatever you want to write here you might be having the a big text here like for the paragraphs also you can do it and that time you can provide the zigzag effect also okay so double click here finally once you are done with this now I'll move this motion path this motion path a little bit up here this has been done so that your ladder would appear now again I'll do for this picture I'll select the start with the previous duration I'll increase it to uh, six seconds let's say and I'll provide a delay for the first animation that will start after half a second or maybe 0.5 second now let's try to play this how it looks like now I'll need to increase the delay here that would be 1.25 now let's try to play one more time I need to increase it now the text this has been appearing a bit fast and the pencil is moving slow so for the pencil moment for the pencil moment I need to either the decrease the duration let me say let's try with the five seconds now play this okay and if you're talking about the text the effect option let's try to increase a bit 0.15 now how it goes let's write with a pen
So you need to do a little bit like setting for this stuff, uh, how the pen moves and how the letter appears. And after that, that would be perfectly fine. There are a simple trick here. That first thing is that you need to provide the animation to your text and that animation has to be appear. You will provide the effect as uh, the letter would be shown one after the other, every alphabet. And for the motion path you need to create, you need to write these letters. Whatever you have written here, you can move your pen a little bit, like similar to the thing that you have written here. And after doing it, you can move this motion path a little bit upwards. And the last thing would be that you need to provide a delay in the text that you have written. Because once your object is going to move here, that particular duration, for that duration we don't want the text to appear here. So we need to do a little bit setting, a little bit duration you need to provide and then you want to play both the animation together. I'll click on play here, your pencil is moving and it's writing. Let's write with a pen or pencil. So this is how we have created the effect. So we have multiple effects now. I have tried to written here Edupedia world. Now let me play this animation. Your pencil is here. It's moving here and writing Edupedia world. Similarly the first animation that we have created. Learning PowerPoint tips. I'll click on play here and it's going to write learning PowerPoint tips. So this is how we can create the, the handwritten or the pencil writing effect. You can write a list like a number of points you can write here and similarly for 4-5 or five points you can create the similar effect. So this is how you can give a pencil writing effect to the object, to the text. So this is one of the tip that you can use in your PowerPoint presentations. And I'll be appearing with more tricks that how you can write with the pen or you can give the crayon effect and the pencil written effect to the text and the objects also. So that was it for this session. Thanks everyone. Thank you for watching Edupedia World videos.